Away from security matters now, the presidency has replied from a vice president, Atiku Abubakar, on his recent comments about the government's economic policies, insisting the PDP candidate is out of touch with Nigeria's realities. In a statement by special advisor to the president on information and strategy, the former vice president should end his grand illusions and fantasies. The statement mentioned that President Tinubu's removal of fuel subsidy eliminated incentive for corruption within the NNPC. It also mentioned that an estimated 5.3, 5.4 trillion naira savings from subsidy removal have been directed toward infrastructure development. Without factoring in oil sales, the presidency says revenue proceeds generated by the Federal Inland Revenue Service almost doubled in the first quarter of the year 2024. In addition, the president dismissed Mr. Abubakar's suggestion to privatize Nigeria's four government-owned refineries, insisting it lacks originality and it is inadequate to meet the country's fuel needs.